In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make a sticker that looks like this from one of your photos. Notice that the sticker I showed contains text on top of a subject as well as an outline that's different from the one available in the Messages app. First, find the photo that you want to use. Then open your photo editing program. In this case, I'm using InShot, but you can use any video editor that contains the ability to edit photos. Start a new photo project and add the photo that you just found. First, you might want to tap on Filter. You can add any one of these filters. Notice along the top, you can easily move between the different filters by selecting one of the categories. I'm just going to tap on Adjust. Bring up the brightness and the contrast and the warmth. You can adjust any one of these values by using the slider. Once the value is selected, once you've made adjustments to your photo, the next thing you want to do is cut out the background. So tap on Cut Out and choose the outline. I'm going to crop the photo to remove my hands. You can see this time when you remove the background. Although the entire photo is there, when I go back to the main timeline, you'll see that my hands are no longer visible. The next thing that you need to do is choose an outline. This is why I removed the background inside in shot, rather than using the lift subject feature from the Photos app. Once you've chosen your outline, you can tap on the check mark and there is the photo. When you're using InShot, you can add text anywhere on the photo. In order to have the text visible in a sticker, you need to place the text over top of the subject. You can use text replacement here. If you're going to use text replacement, just type your text replacement abbreviation. Then hit the spacebar, and you can see that you can add text and emojis over top of your subject. Once you've got your text in place, where you think it looks good, you can tap on the check mark and export the photo. You can choose one of these preset styles along the bottom. Once you've got your style set and you're happy with the way your text looks, you can pinch and zoom to adjust the size and position of the text, and then export the photo to your camera roll. If you need to, make adjustments to the position of the text. You can always go back in and do that later. The logo on my jersey was covered up, so I'm going to shrink the text a bit and move it up so that you can see the logo on my jersey. Once you've got your text in position, you can tap anywhere on the screen to dismiss the text box and then export your photo to your camera roll. Now you can close InShot to create the sticker. Open the photos up once more and navigate to your saved photo. This will be the photo that you just exported from InShot. Long press on the photo until you get the lift. Subject animation. If this happens, long press one more time until you see the animation. Then select Add Sticker and your sticker will be added to your sticker collection with the text on top of it. Here's what it looks like if you use that sticker in the Messages app. To use the sticker inside the Messages app, just select it from the sticker panel and tap the Send icon. So in order to add text or emojis to your sticker, they must be over top of the subject. 